Yeah, folks, this COVID package that is being pushed by uh, the Democrats is very, very detrimental to our working families across Iowa, specifically when it comes to the $15 an hour federal minimum wage issue. This would be so harmful for our Iowa small businesses. And the CBO does have the estimate that has been talked about where we would see the loss of 1.4 million jobs across the United States. And bringing it home to me as a mom, you know, someone who did work for fast food in high school and in college at the minimum wage, but then becoming a mother and relying on child care, the impact to Iowa's child care centers at a $15 an hour federal minimum wage would cause an increase of 21% to Iowa's child care centers, 21% passed on to our families. Many Iowa families would not be able to afford that increase in child care. So uh, what, what I have heard, and I'm going to read you a couple quotes, but uh, so don't just take it from me. Here's, here's Iowans speaking to the $15 minimum wage. The Iowa Restaurant Association says this is Nothing short of tone deaf. John, who is a small business owner in Des Moines, says, it would be detrimental to our ability to grow our business and add employees. Tiffany, a small business owner in Pella, there's absolutely no way I could hire the five to 10 people we usually do during their busy season. And Jerry, who is a small business owner in Marshalltown, a mandatory $15 per hour would be very brutal on us when wages go up, prices go up, and your customer count goes down. So these are everyday Iowans, small business owners and operators that would see a detrimental impact if we had to do a $15 per hour federal minimum wage.